Today I'm creating this simple brown smoky liner look. This is perfect for a party or going out. I'm first starting out with a little bit of the Natasha Denona High Glam Concealer, blending that out with my finger just to add a base and then adding a little bit of translucent setting powder on top. For our first color, I'm going to be using the Patrick Ta Major Dimension 3 palette. I'm going to be dipping into this brown shade with a Luxie 235 blending brush. I'm applying this to the outer corner, creating a V shape and then blending it towards the center of the lid. This doesn't have to be very polished or perfect. We just want the depth in the outer corner. I'm slowly building up the color and then blending out the edges. As you can see, I'm kind of creating a sideways V shape in the outer corner, bringing it about halfway up towards the brow bone and then blending it onto the lid a little bit and a little bit into the crease, just using whatever's left on the brush to do so, so we're not adding too much color. So this is about as blended as we want it to look, just very soft edges, no harsh lines, taking up about halfway of the outer half of the lid. Next, I'm going in with the Jones Road Just A Sec eyeshadow. It's like a cream eyeshadow. I'm using a Morphe H2 brush, and I'm sweeping this onto the front portion of the lid, bringing it up into the crease a little bit, like so. Just kind of feathering out that top edge so there isn't a harsh line, and then I'm kind of feathering it into that brown shade in the outer half of the lid, like so. So just add like a little bit of pop of shine on the front portion of the lid. Just making sure I get rid of any edges. Next, with the same brush, I'm dipping into this matte white and applying it to the inner corner. Here I'm kind of sweeping it onto the lid a little bit as well as onto the lower lid area. Just kind of feathering out all the edges to brighten up the inner corner of the eye. So I'm just using whatever's on the brush to feather it out, not adding too much color but I'm pulling it onto the lid a little bit on top of that shimmery taupe shade from Jones Road, and then bring it up into the crease, just so everything looks very bright. Next, this Moody Cow Pigment from Carla Cosmetics, again with that same brush. I'm just lightly tapping this into the inner corner. I don't want this to be too pigmented. I just want it to be a little pop of sparkle on the inner corner, and then I'm bringing it onto the lower portion of the inner corner as well. Just using whatever's left on the brush to kind of fade out the edges to make it diffused a little bit. Next, for eyeliner, I'm using the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Grip Eyeliner in the shade Brown Denim in shade 220. Lining my waterline and then my upper lash line. I like to do this in little sections, so here I'm starting in the outer corner, making this our thickest area. This doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to smoke it out with a little bit of eyeshadow. And then I'm going to go ahead and start lining the center of the lid, just cleaning up the line and just working my way towards the inner corner and gradually making the line thinner as we make our way towards the inner corner. Like so. I like to use little side to side motions. And then lining that last portion. And then I'm doing the same thing on the lower lash line, making it thicker in the outer corner and making it gradually thinner towards the inner corner. With an eye smudge liner brush from Huda Beauty, I'm dipping into a darker brown and then I'm smudging out the liner on the top edge, just patting it on top and then using little side to side motions to smudge out that top edge to make it look smoky. And then we're going in with a flat shader brush and a lighter brown to further blend it out, like so adding a little bit more of the darker shade if any of it got wiped away. Doing the same thing on the lower lash line, just making sure not to pull it down too far, just blending out that bottom edge a little bit. Keeping the line thinner towards the inner corner and then again adding a lighter brown with a flat shader brush from the craft store to just further blend out that bottom edge. Wiping away any fallout with a big fluffy brush and then adding an inner corner wing with the Better Than Sex liner from Too Faced in the shade Chocolate, cleaning up any edges. And then I'm going in with mascara and lashes. I do have a tutorial on the inner corner wing on my blog if you want to check that out on ashleykaylamakeup.com. This is the Naturally Better Than Sex mascara from Too Faced. The lashes I'm using are the Ardell Naked Lashes in style 424 gluing those on and that completes the look thank you so much for watching i will link everything down below in the comments be sure to subscribe down below so you don't miss out on my next video and i hope to see you in the next one bye